Hey, how's it going bosses? It is the boss here once again with another video for you guys. Today guys is going to be, yes, another YouTube interview video. Um, yes guys, today we are going to be interviewing the YouTuber known as, uh, Kobe Toishi. I'm sorry man if I'm butchering your name, I apologize, I am really not good with fancy names like that. However, we're going to be interviewing him for today about his YouTube experience and, uh, seems like a pretty cool guy as well guys. I've noticed that he does a lot of anime content and whatnot, so if you guys are interested in, I guess, anime videos or, you know, just want to go check out his channel, uh, check the link in the description down below. It'll take you directly to his YouTube channel, so go check out some of his stuff, guys. Subscribe if you guys are interested in it, and, uh, yeah, just go and check him out. By the way, guys, let us get right into his YouTube story. Let's start the interview. So what made you start doing YouTube, man? What made me start YouTube was the comedy sketch YouTubers like Smosh, College Humor, and all that guys. But the reason why I started YouTube is because I wanted to put my own twist on the comedy sketch type thing, YouTube thing. Ah. I want to make a, like, a live action anime channel where I don't just watch anime. I actually make my own live action version of my vision of an anime. Yeah, that's why I actually started this channel. Do you have any inspirations for the content that you make on your YouTube channel? Yes, I actually do. Uh, the inspiration based on most of my videos, the anime based videos are mostly on Lost Pass or any anime like Boku no Hero or any type of anime that I like actually, but mostly Lost Pass is my inspiration to do anime type stuff. But if you say my overall type of content, I would say my inspiration would either be Casey Neistat or maybe Jimbo Shreds, best guy ever. Jimbo Shreds mostly, but any anime based channel is my inspiration. So what's been a great YouTube experience that you've had so far in the course of your YouTube career? My greatest experience on YouTube so far is meeting new people on YouTube, me making new friends on YouTube, even getting to collab with one of my idols back then when I was still dubbing. Anya the Peasant, I used to, I, I collabed with her once, that was the greatest experience ever. But overall, my greatest experience was meeting new people, connecting with other small YouTubers, like the small YouTube community, I love those guys, this awesome page. Yeah, that's basically my greatest experience with YouTube so far. Do you have any future plans for, for your YouTube channel? Mm, yeah, I do have future plans for my YouTube, I'm actually planning to make my own live action anime opening with an edited version of one of my favorite songs and I'm planning to make a web series once I hit 500 or 1000 and it depends on my mood and uh, I'm also planning a lot more comedy skits more comedy sketches, a lot of vlogs and I kinda got a lot planned actually for this channel <laughs> yeah so what are some favorite and least favorite video games of yours? favorite games have to be uh, Team Fortress 2, League of Legends uh, Overwatch somewhat, and um, I have to say Terraria, then my least favorite games of all time has to be Fortnite, yes I hate Fortnite, uh, I still like PUBG a bit, and um, yeah, Fortnite, and um, I'm gonna have to say Beetlejuice on the SNES, uh, yeah, those are my least favorite games, I like a lot of games, those are the only games I really don't like. And what are some major goals that you have for your life, that you've set for yourself, or just goals in general? My major goal right now is to get my channel up and going, a lot of views, a lot of better quality videos. That's my major goal for now, but my major goal in life is to actually graduate from my college and become a film director somewhat and still keep my channel intact. Yeah, I always wanted to be a film director or a storyboard writer, so I'm starting it off with my channel right now. So, yeah, that's basically my major goals. And that's going to do for today's interview video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy yet another small YouTube interview. Again, big thanks to uh, Kibo for letting me interview him. Um, it was really cool uh, talking with you, man. It was really cool seeing all your answers to all these different questions about YouTube and a couple different things about, um, I guess, things about you in general. But thank you once again, man, for being on the channel. Um, if you guys want to go check out his content um, and see if it interests you, I'll check out the link in the description. Go and support him if you wish. And, of course, guys, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a like. Uh, if you did like it, subscribe to 
the channel if you're new to catch uh, my future videos and streams if you want to catch them with that bell on and comment down below what you guys thought of this video and of course if you want to be involved in an interview video in the future with all that in mind guys thank you so much for watching until next time bosses peace Thank <music> you.